Hey everyone, Mike Curtis here again, creator of the U Design System, where I help you apply the skills that you already have to yourself to help you design how you're experienced by others. And I'm really excited today. I have an article that I wrote over on Medium that is a, a pretty fun read, and I wanted to do a live recording of that. And so we're going to jump right into it. Uh, the title of this article is The Creative Industry Needs a Few More Outlaws. A creative outlaw can venture where others won't go and show the world the brilliance of what can be if only we dare to defy. Outlaws from the Old West stand out with a distinct allure. They were the rule breakers, the mavericks who wrote their own scripts in the gritty openness of the frontier. We need more of them. We need the wild cards, the ones who see possibilities where others see dead ends. But hold on, before you raise an eyebrow, let me clarify. This isn't about glorifying the lawless or praising the rule-breaking and unethical. Rather, it's about extracting the essence of what made outlaws captivating and translating it into fuel for today's creative industry. The Outlaw Spirit An outlaw can prove impossible wrong. She can look adversity dead in the face, saddle up, and take it head on. Yet, in a world brimming with AI, automation, templates, and formulas, true originality is a rare gem. We've fallen prey to easy paths and quiet voices. Many of our creations wither under the weight of conformity. This is where the outlaw spirit comes into play. Not in the sense of lawlessness, but in embodying traits like resilience, resourcefulness, survival, and independent thinking. Our creative industry needs the bold and the fearless who can defy and challenge. Someone who doesn't confuse comfort with excellence. A creative outlaw can venture where others won't go and show the world the brilliance of what can be if only we dare to defy. The seven traits of the outlaw spirit. Number one, resilience. Outlaws know the art of bouncing back. Picture a lone outlaw riding through the desert, facing the relentless sun, and still pushing forward. There's a clear skill we see in her, resilience. As creatives, we often face rejection, criticism, and failures. Like the outlaws, we need the grit to dust ourselves off, dig in our spurs, and keep riding. Failures are stepping stones. Roadblocks make us stronger and temper our creative resolve. When your ideas get knocked down, Channel the skill of resilience. Number two, resourcefulness. Outlaws were masters of making do with what they had. As creatives, this translates to innovation. Can you look at the resources at hand, no matter how limited, and ask, what can I create with this? This approach encourages us to think outside the box, to see potential in the mundane, and to turn constraints into springboards for creativity. Does everything need a textbook? Hone the art of improvisation. Look for solutions in the ingenuity of the moment. Number three, bravery and courage. Outlaws dare to be different. The creative world has plenty of ideas. What we need are bold ideas. The outlaws were not known for their timidity. They took risks. Feedback didn't phase them. They questioned the norm. In your creative career, this means having the courage to explore uncharted territories, to present ideas that might initially seem outlandish, and to stand by your creative convictions even when they go against the grain, even when the feedback hurts. When everyone zigs, find the courage to zag. Number four, leadership. Many outlaws were natural leaders, drawing people to their cause. They could guide with vision and rally others around them toward a common purpose. Leadership is less about authority and more about vision, example, and inspiration. A creative outlaw thrives in an environment where ideas can flourish, where team members feel valued and heard, and where the collective goal is innovation, achievement, and excellence. Inspire by doing, not just by saying. Demonstrate the bravery you wish to see in your team. When, you, when they see you taking risks, they'll be encouraged to do the same. 
Number five, independence. Outlaws lived by their own rules. For you as a creative, this independence is about not being shackled by conventions or trends. Trust your creative instincts. Independence is the freedom to create what feels authentic to yourself. This doesn't mean disregarding your audience, stakeholders, ethical guidance, or market trends, but it does mean not letting them dull your, dull your creative essence or what you know to be true. Number six, strategy. Outlaws could pull off a heist with scary effectiveness. And no, I'm not suggesting you do that, but strategy was key for any successful outlaw, and it's no different in the creative industry. This involves understanding the landscape you're up against, identifying opportunities, and planning your approach. Whether it's launching a new website, marketing campaign, piece of art, or literary work, strategic thinking ensures that your creative efforts hit the mark. Anticipate moves. Think steps ahead. And when the game changes, be ready to adapt your strategy with the same calm precision. Finally, number seven, survival skills. Outlaws could survive among the harshest of competition. The creative industry is competitive too, often unforgiving, relentless, and unpredictable. I've even heard the job market for creative roles often referred to as the Wild West. Like outlaws who knew how to navigate the rugged wilderness, creatives need to hone their survival skills. Adapt to your environment, but also be unafraid to claim your space. This means being adaptable, continuously learning, staying ahead of trends, building a strong and honest network, and being prepared to pivot when necessary. Make the most of what's available in front of you. Build up your allies and know how to use your surroundings to your advantage. We need more of you. Don't step on the principles that define you. Every time we choose the easy path of imitation over the challenging road of innovation, we walk past the doors of opportunity, leaving them unopened and the treasures of ingenuity undiscovered. Choose the path that makes your heart race. Weave these outlaw traits into your career. Start with your mindset. Accept the idea of being a creative outlaw, someone who respects the rules of the game but isn't afraid to rewrite them when necessary. Embrace failure as a teacher. Outlaws failed and got back on their horse again. Welcome failures and setbacks as part of your career. Analyze them, learn from them, and use them to direct where you go and what you do next. Saddle up against your limitations. Look at your limitations as creative challenges. Design your way out of them. Ask yourself how you can turn them into advantages. Some of your best ideas will come when working within your toughest constraints. Dare to stand out. Don't be afraid to raise your hand and present ideas that might seem unconventional. The most groundbreaking ideas were once considered outrageous. It's an automatic no unless you speak your mind. Post it. Share it. Let your voice be heard. Lead with inspiration. If you're in a leadership role, focus on inspiring and enabling your team. Then, remember that leadership doesn't require a title. Create a space where creativity is nurtured and valued and where you build others up. Stay true to your creative vision. While it's important to consider market trends and customer preferences, don't let them stifle your creative expertise. Trust in your unique perspective. Plan strategically. Before launching your creative work, take the time to strategize. Understand your audience, your customers, key metrics, the market, and how your work solves someone's problem and fits into the bigger picture. Adapt and evolve. Stay curious and open to learning. The creative industry is ever-evolving, and so should you. Keep updated on new trends, technologies, and methodologies. Beware the comfort of the path most taken. This isn't a call to rebel, nor am I rallying the gunslingers to jump into action and wreak havoc on our craft. But your pioneering spirit is essential for true creative breakthroughs. Ride hard and fast past the copycats. Be relentless in your pursuit of the unprecedented. 
be vigilant against the lure of how it's always been done. We need you, the creative outlaw, to break new ground, push new boundaries, and usher in a new era of innovation and artistic expression. Let your work shout your defiance against mediocrity. Become the creative outlaw you were meant to be. Thanks for taking the time to listen to this today. If you enjoyed this, if you enjoy this kind of content at all, where I read my articles and hopefully provide you some amount of value with it, uh, I just really appreciate a like and a subscribe if you want. If not, no big deal, uh, but I'll just continue to make these if I see uh, that people are enjoying them. So thank you, and I hope you have a wonderful day.